Hi folks, this is Nathan from the IBM Watson Developer Cloud team. Today we're doing a technical deep dive into our Node.js SDK. The SDK is just a library that makes it easier to interact with the Watson services from within Node.js. We have a couple of prerequisites first before you can get going. Obviously you need Node.js installed. You can download that from Node.js.org. And then you'll need some credentials for our services. So you can get those from bluemix.net and there's a great getting started guide uh, in our documentation. You can get that at ibm.com slash watson developer cloud. Now, there's a little bit of setup work that you'll have to do, but I already took care of. First, you'd want to run npm init, and that will create a package.json file for you. And then you'll want to npm install Watson Developer Cloud. All right, so we'll start out grabbing our dependencies. We have Watson. Let's just do a quick check, make sure this is working. And ta-da, all of the services right there. So we'll get rid of that. Um, to actually create a service instance, you need credentials, as I was saying before. So I have those saved in a file named auth.js. And I won't show you that file, but I'll give you a quick glance of what it looks like. So it's just the service name, the username, the password, the version, and an optional version date, which is kind of like a more specific version. So back to our index. Let's create a tone analyzer instance. do something with it. Let's get some text to analyze. All right. Almost every API in the SDK uses the same signature where you get an object with the parameters and then a callback function with an error and the result. So let's do some quick error checking. And that out of the way, let's take a look at the results. This is a nice little trick that gets you pretty printed JSON instead of the normal block law one line. So there it goes. Lots of JSON back from the service. So you get tones grouped into categories. Um, so let's let's make that output a little bit nicer.
All right, let's see. Cool. Interesting that I have no score for writing. Probably there's not enough text. All right. So let's try another service. How about language translation? We'll get us a little more room here. Let's convert this to Spanish. Go ahead and comment this out for the moment. There we go. Saludos de IBM Watson. Haha. <laughs> All right. So what are we going to do with translated Spanish text? How about we have it announced over text to speech? I'm going to add in a couple more libraries. These are ones that I had already installed. Just save us a little time. text-to-speech service instance. Alright, and once we have our results, we're going to synthesize it. And we want wave audio. And it's in Spanish, so we want to choose a Spanish voice. a wave reader instance ahead of time. This will process the wave header to get the format out of it and extract the header data before we send it on to the speakers. Insight into what's going on. All right, let's see how this works. Saludos de IBM Watson. <laughs> okay, hopefully you could hear that. It did speak Spanish audio that sounded correct to me. If we wanted to, say, save it in a file instead of playing it on the system speakers, which is probably more useful in some cases, um, we could get rid of all this and pipe it into a file system I need to make, need to load the FS module to make this work. All right, 
let's run it again. And there we go, output.wave exists. So I could open that and it will play in iTunes. All right, let's do a quick review. So we've got the Watson Developer Cloud Node.js SDK. We've grabbed it and got it set up. We've created a tone analyzer instance. We've analyzed some text, pretty printed the results. Then we took language translation, translated that text from English to Spanish, and we then synthesized the Spanish text into actual spoken voice. We played that on the speakers and saved it to a file, all in the space of maybe 10 minutes. Now, there are 20 or 30 additional Watson services beyond these three that we've looked at. So my encouragement is go out, play with these, play with some of the other services, have some fun, and let us know what you come up with. So thanks for watching and have a great day.